Hey, my gators. Hey, my gators. Welcome back to the Single Mom versus the Fixer Upper on How to DIY Wine Saver Dime. So, you know this channel is about how to's, doing it yourself, and how to save a dime, right? But here's the funky part. I have been on a journey to have zero waste. I know that's kind of like, I ain't gonna say impossible, but it's kind of next to it. But meaning like not waste as much. Be mindful of the things that I'm wasting for one. And for two, I'm trying to get away from a lot of toxic things. Now we know that when you go to getting the better stuff, the less toxic stuff and the stuff that's organic and, you know, better for us, it usually costs much, much more. Now, this right here is salsa. I didn't have this since I think I got this in May. And I only have been using it for um dishwashing so i just squirt a little bit in my dish water and i wash dishes like that i got away from putting bleach in my water and i've been only using that not having any problems do know this guys soapy does not mean that it's getting clean suds does not mean that it's getting clean just so you know okay so i have been on a journey to find something and find a way to make this myself because I'm like, hmm, I already make my own oils for my body and my, my daughter's bodies. And I also make our own body wash and our shampoos. Now, they try different things here and there, but usually they stick to our basics. Um, and I've been creating our own body washes and oils and shampoos and stuff and braiding, um, hair braiding spray, and, hair, braid spray and like natural hair spray for years since Rizzy was even before Rizzy was thought of. And she's going to be 15. This right here was $62 on Amazon, okay? Even though it might last me about a year, I'm still trying to figure out if I can make this. And the research that I've done, I've seen a lot of this. So this is a box I got from Walmart. I'm going to open it with you. And I want you to talk to me in the comments because I do talk back. Now, can't find my razor, so we're going to go with this. <laughs> I got this. And it's two bars of the Kirk's 100% Premium Coconut Oil Gentle Castile Soap for sensitive, sensitive skin friendly, fragrance free. Now, Rizzy has sensitive skin. Rizzy has sensitive skin. She um, dealt with eczema when she was very young. And I've been doing everything to keep that at bay and not having her have issues with it. So I found a lot of videos and Pinterest and Google some things. This one was a soap that this soap has been around for a long time. And one bar of this on walmart.com is it actually is 208. So I guess it's kind of high where I am, but some people say that they get their bars for like 160, 150 or something like that, but still. One bar can make I think the lady said either a gallon or a half a gallon. Either way, $2, right? Even if it was $4. That is eliminating almost, if this was $62, that is eliminating $58 of savings. Because all I have to do is take this, add water, and whatever else I need, uh, glycerin, to make a Castile soap. So, if you've tried this and you're old school and you know about this, I also was looking into that Zolt. Zolt for making my own laundry soap. But I've been getting mixed reviews in regards to the... Um, way that it can affect certain machines if you don't use hot water but you use cold or warm water so if you know about Zolt what is the best way to use that how do you use it do you just use it as a bar to stain treat before you wash or do you make a laundry soap with it and create your own washing soap and use it that way so let me know in the comments and if you use Kirk's before some people just use this as a bar soap they literally use this wash their body with this and they love it and they say it's a great cleansing soap. And I know that because Dr. Bronner's Castor Soap is amazing. Um, but it's expensive as well. Um, and that's what I use. Like, I'll use my regular body wash. But when I do exfoliation, I like to add Dr. Bronner's to my body wash, the peppermint soap. So talk to me in the comments and tell me what you think. Um, by the time you see this, um, I would have done more research. But before I actually use these, because when I do use these to make my Castile soap, I will be doing a video. This is what this channel is about. Helping you find better alternatives, better methods to protect your family, to keep you guys safe, and to save your money. Because it's worth it. Even if it takes you time to do this, 
it will last you much longer and you know what's inside of it so if you're down with that and you like that type of content that's what this channel is all about make sure you join the family by hitting that subscribe button hit the notification bell so you're notified every time i load a new video and with that being said talk to me in the comments and i will talk back lady gators